Well, coverage of the 45th presidential inauguration can be seen right here on KXOI 4. But will you plan your morning around the event? Our Jack Ferris live in the studio tonight. He's working for you out asking people that very question today, Jack. Yes, Nadine, history will be made tomorrow as the nation will have our first presidential inauguration in eight years and just the third this century. However, locally, the event doesn't seem to move the needle as much as you might think. I'm not watching the inauguration because I don't care. Yeah. <laughs> no, I don't. I don't care to watch it. I don't really care about all that stuff too much. Caitlin's feelings seem to be the majority of those in downtown Spokane today as the lunch hour crowd planned to do just about anything but watch the event. Uh, working and ignoring it. What time is it on at? <laughs> <It's early. laughs> I feel that I'm not excited about it and I'm going to pay attention to what's on at hand. Uh, what's at my doorstep as opposed to what's coming. I didn't even actually know I forgot about voting and then I just woke up and everyone was like Trump won and I was like Woo, yay. <laughs> Not even the potential for the unexpected was enough to sway these downtown patrons. Now nah, my mom will fill me in. Yeah. <laughs> she, she'll watch it. <laughs> yeah I know I'm gonna hear about the fireworks and I'd like to see them firsthand but I think it's going to go down one way or another, and me watching it and getting all worked up isn't going to help anything. It should be noted that apathy for the inauguration ceremony doesn't necessarily reflect the same for the nation's future. I mean, I'm interested to see what Trump can do. I think that our country needs to change, so definitely if you can change it, great. If not, goodbye. <laughs> Now, Nadine and I spoke with about a dozen other people off camera, and still the vast majority, for one reason or another, had no plan to watch it. Not unlike a sporting event in the middle of the day, most just said they'd catch the highlights later. Reporting from studio, Jack Ferris, KXOY4 News. Well, they can watch our news. That's right. And get the highlights. As they